All right, welcome back to another video. My name is Nicholas, and this is Eating the African Way. Uh, today, we are. I decided to share with you my breakfast, my breakfast, a Ugandan breakfast. The keyword is Ugandan breakfast. Breakfast because we, we are from different countries, and breakfast uh, it means a lot to us. So when it comes to Ugandans, breakfast is not only about snacks; it's about food. Food. But we're going to go into details, and then I'll give uh, I'll give uh, differences between a breakfast and lunch because some of you get confused because the same food we eat for breakfast is the same food we always eat for lunch, but sometimes cook differently. So we are going to look into that. So I'm going to start with uh, jackfruit. This is a gift I got uh, early morning today. Today early morning from Mama Winnie's restaurant. I know you have seen this pl this place in one of the recent videos. But yeah, if you missed that video. I'm going to drop it in the description box. She, she took us through the process how she prepares her food. So most of you want to come and be part of the cooking. Don't just call, don't don't just make the phone calls. Make your you make yourself come physically. <laughs> yeah. Come physically. Come physically. Don't just call and uh, make programs, but come and be part of this. So if you if you missed it. In the description box, you're going to find that video there. So I'm starting with jackfruit. Ah, one of one of my favorite fruits. Uh, one of my favorite fruits in Uganda. Oh God. So I think in two minutes from now, I'm going to receive my breakfast. But this is a uh, this is a this is a good treaty I always get from this place. Mm. <laughs> Wow. Mm. Mm. Uh, imagine starting your day with cup fruit. We used to call this cup fruit back home, cup fruit, <laughs> uh, which is fene in my language. Mm. But along the video, you can also share what breakfast means to you. What do you, what do you have for breakfast? Mm? This is what I'm going to share in this video. How Ugandans. What Ugandans have for breakfast? That is it for the kafruit. Kafruit. <laughs> kafruit. So we are going to we are going to have our, our breakfast. You might be asking yourself why I've seated outside. This is this is uh, the same thing I always talk about. The customers don't want to be don't want to be seeing the camera. Don't want to see the camera. So that's why I always get somewhere where I can peacefully do this video and share it with you. So let us receive our breakfast. Mm. <laughs> our breakfast is here. I think we need to take away like a fruit, jackfruit. <laughs> fene. Fene, fene is a Luganda name, the, but we used to call it kafruit. You know, when you visit Uganda, you shouldn't forget it. You can either call it kafruit or fene. So let us, let us dive into our, our breakfast and then we see what they have, what they have for us. Let me take a fruit away because it is bringing in the house price. So, let me keep it late for later. Hmm? Oh God. Are you still with us? Hmm? Let me go wash my hands and come back. Just seconds. Don't go anywhere. <laughs> don't go, don't go, don't go. <laughs> you know, I was, I was going through the comment section and then one of, uh, someone who watched the video started talking about microbacteria, microparasites, and I was like, this channel is about food. There are things I will not understand. And it was like, I should use a fork when I'm eating my food. Why, should, why do I use my fingers? And I'm like, using my fingers has been part of us for centuries. Even before the forks came in, we used to have, we used to use our fingers and no one ever got sick. But now people are using forks by, and they are dying from diseases they can't even understand. They don't even know. Hmm? So let, us, let me let me stop there and then and enjoy our dish. Oh, this is what we have. This is what we have. 
Oh my goodness. Wow. I don't know how many colors you can see from the from from your screen from your yeah from your screen but this is so colorful. This is what we're having for breakfast. I think these are called French beans, if I'm not mistaken. And also a piece of meat, rice, and then matoke. And also we are, we are along the road, that's why you, you're getting a lot of noisy in the background. The cars are moving, the border borders are moving, people are moving. So, let us enjoy what we have on the table. <laughs> oh God. Thank you so much for keeping yourself on eating the African way. So let us dive into this. It's going to be one of the shortest videos we're going to have on the channel. Ah, I think we should start with my talk. My talk, my talk. Ah. One of the bad side of being a content creator is by the time you eat your food, it's going to be cold, cold. But these are some of the things we bear because we want to give you the best. We don't want you to miss out anything. Mm. I know some of you, if, if you have such a meal, such a breakfast you're not going to have lunch because this is i think this is so heavy for some of you but to us ugandans you know but don't forget to check out mama Winnie restaurant uh, along nyanama road um, the, the video that has more details that has more information about this place is in the descri <laughs> description box of this video get it watch it get the number call her Make an or make orders. Mm. Ah. Oh. So as you watch, you can also tell us which kind of breakfast do you have in your country. What do you have? When? So just just let us know in the comment section. Where it creates confusion is uh, some of you, uh, some of you always ask me, but the same food you have for breakfast is the same food you have for lunch. You know, the cooking creates the difference. The cooking. So, matoke for lunch, it is always mashed and cooked in banana leaves, wrapped together and, and makes what we call Murugana Chibampo Omuumbo. Omuumbo. That is what we call a wrap. Yeah. But, but for, for breakfast, the bananas, are not, the bananas are not wrapped in banana leaves. They are cooked like this. So, so if you find someone eating the, this kind of food for lunch, just know maybe that person that person missed breakfast but that's how the, that that's what creates creates difference the way the food is cooked the way the food is cooked it can be the same food but cooked differently hmm. I've seen some of you always uh, complain about our prices that they are so high. I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know why. But no one has ever complained about the prices here. I think we are used to it. We are used to it. We are used to it. And uh, this, this breakfast is going to cost you around 4,000 Ugandan shillings. I don't know how, how, I don't know how, much is, how much is that in dollars. But I'll put that on the screen. But 4,000 Ugandan shillings for breakfast, for this kind of a meal. Woo! Mm. So I think, I've, I think I've answered one of the requests. So keep them coming in, keep them dropping in. Don't make those so complicated ones. Make the easier, easier ones to do. Make, make the easier ones uh, to make. So for breakfast, it was so easy. I can always come back to Mama Winnie's place, Mama Winnie restaurant, and have breakfast, and have lunch. But in case there is something you missed out, you can also tell me, I can always come back to this place and give more information. You can always, you can always do that. 
Mm. Wow. But this is one of the best things you're going to enjoy when you come to Uganda. Our breakfast, our lunch. Ah, there is, there is more, there is more, there is more. And you all know, Uganda is the food basket in East Africa. I, I will stand proudly on that. Uganda is a food basket. I haven't been to Tanzania, but I don't know. I don't know. Maybe when I get there, I will get something different. But for now, even Tanzanians say Uganda is a food basket. Kenyans are like, ah, I wish we were, we were Ugandans. <laughs> for Randis and Burundians, I, I don't want to say much about them. But soon I'll be there. Maybe. I don't know. Soon, soon. So what we are having now is one of the many breakfasts you're going to have. There are many, one of the many options you're going to have. But there's a one for cassava, there's one for uh, Irish potatoes, one for so many foods, so many foods. So this is just one of the options you're going to have. In case you don't want matoke, there's rice, there is so many foods. But here, what I'm having is uh, also rice. I know some of you complain about rice, it is it, that it wasn't part of us. But some of us have grown, have grown up eating these foods. Hmm? So we shouldn't bring back, there are so many things we, should, we shouldn't always bring back. We need to let the, some of the, what happened in the past stay in the past. We need to move on. We should move on. Yeah? We should move on. <laughs> some of you are benefiting from what happened. Hmm? So we shouldn't bring back that. Ah. Yeah, but I'm doing this video in central Uganda, again, to like, like 23 minutes away from Kampala or Pentebe Road. My number will be in the description box in case you want to visit this place. And also their number is on the screen right now. You know, one of the things that always hurt me so much is I, prov I provide all the information, but then again, you ask in the comment section, you didn't share their numbers because you skipped the video. I always share everything you would want to know about the place okay sometimes i miss the costs but if i miss the we sometimes i miss the prices but if i miss them i always uh, pin the first comment i pin the comment providing all all what i missed in the in the what in the video because i'm always careful i don't want to, i don't want you to miss out anything I think today lunch is covered. Maybe I'll, 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 I'll come back for supper. <laughs> oh, don't just watch. Uh, drop a comment. Drop your thoughts in the comment section. Like the video. And also share it with so many people out there. In, in case you're watching on your television. I know some of you watch uh, uh, through your televisions. But also you can get your phone, like the video, comment, and also share it with family members. Eh? Let them sit and enjoy it. Also, let them share their thoughts in the comment section. Hmm? Drop, drop what you want to see next. Because this is what I do on this channel. I always answer your requests. Made a guau rabu warmi. Mm. <laughs> By the time we leave this plate, this we have to we have to finish this plate. Mm? This was so little for me. I shouldn't leave anything on the plate. And even ask for more. <laughs> <laughs> Did I, did I invite you? Hmm? Did I invite you? Oh, I think I was so hungry today. But feel free to be here spiritually, <laughs> physically. I will, I will always eat on your behalf. Physically, I'll be here on your behalf. Spiritually, you can be here with me. I don't know how you do that, but. Hmm.
Walubo mkaza imili deli Ngozaze kukoba antunuli de mkwa mbeso wani Chika gamba nebi nebisa evidenzi bina kwa zilongare bina mpisa Hmm I think that was it for camera man. take I think that was it for today. Thank you so much for being part of it in the African way. Thank you so much for loving this channel. Drop your phone in the comment section. What do you think about this? But what do you think about the prices? Hmm? Would you afford it? Hmm? Would you? Would you come for it? But also there are other places where you can find it uh, way less. Not not like like a 2K at 3k or oh, 2500 shillings so it depends about the place and also the the the, the, the food the quality of the food yes nowadays people no longer sell their pla their places because some people sell their their places don't even the food but nowadays people are trying to improve on the foods i think along the along the way they also improve on their places but for now let us enjoy the food and this brings us to the end of this video. Catch up in this video. Bye bye. Peace. Love you all. What about younger? Simon. We don't believe him. Hmm. So what do you need to be safe in your world? Yeah. So we mission is no be that complete. Hmm? Is that you are to come up. Eh, you are <laughs> <laughs> Ha ha ha. Ndiyo likasiru. Ha ha ha.